Biological Importance of Sodium and Potassium A typical 70 kg man contains about 90 gram of sodium and 170 gram of potassium compared with only 5 gram of iron and 0 0.06 gram of copper. Potassium, sodium and other electrolytes dissolve in water and help carry an electrical charge. Potassium and sodium are two of the most important ions in our nervous system. Potassium and sodium ions act as power generators inside the cells of our body. The sodium-potassium pump describes a mechanism in which sodium and potassium ions move in and out of your cells. Each time this happens, an electrical charge is produced. Sodium ions are found primarily on the outside of cells, being located in blood plasma and in the interstitial fluid which surrounds the cells. Potassium ions are the most abundant cations within cell fluids where they activate many enzymes, participate in the oxidation of glucose to produce ATP. If you want to move your fingers, your brain transmits a message to the muscles in your hand. Neurons transmit that message. Neurons use ions to communicate. Potassium and sodium are responsible for the transmission of nerve signals. The intracellular Na plus concentration is lower than the extracellular. To equalize the difference, Na plus automatically flows into the cell via channels in the cell membrane, but it is continuously pumped out again by means of the sodium-potassium pump. There is a considerable variation in the concentration of sodium and potassium ions found on the opposite sides of cell membranes. As a typical example, in blood plasma, sodium is present to the extent of 143 millimole per liter, whereas the potassium level is only 5 millimole per liter within the red blood cells. These concentrations change to 10 millimole per liter Na plus and 105 millimole per liter K plus. The sodium-potassium pump is the key to functions such as cardiac and renal activity as well as all general transport processes into and out of the cell.